Good day mga kids! The lessons that we'll discuss in this module will help you understand solid figures. The video is divided into three lessons. This is lesson one, visualizes and describes the different solid figures. Cube, prism, pyramid, cylinder, cone, and spear using various concrete and pictorial models. After going through this lesson, you are expected to describe the different solid figures. Identify the solid figure represented by real objects. What I know. Direction. Choose the letter of the correct answer and write it on a sheet of paper. Number one. What solid figure is described by a dice? A. Cone B. Cube C. Prism the pyramid. Number two, what solid figure is described by a water hose? A circle, B cylinder, C prism, D pyramid. Number three, which of the following is not a plain figure? A cone, B paper, C pentagon, D square. Number 4. Which is not a solid figure? A cube, B cylinder, C prism, D rectangle. Number 5. These are the three dimensions a solid figure except one. A bit, B height, C length, D width. Number six, it is also the side of a solid figure. A deep, B face, C front, D height. Number seven, it is where the edges of a solid meet. A base, B face, C length, D vertex. Number eight, it is a solid figure where all sides are polygons. A patterns, B pentagon, C plane, D polyhedrons. Number nine, how many lateral faces does a cube have? A eight, B four, C six, D none. Number 10, which is a net of a pyramid? Is it A, B, C, or D? This is lesson 1, visualizing and describing the different solid figures. Geometry is all around us. Anything with physical characteristics is geometrically formed. Geometry is a branch of mathematics that studies the sizes, shapes, positions, angles, and dimension of things. The concept we will be learning will increase our knowledge about geometry. This lesson deals mainly on visualizing and describing solid figures. A polygon is a simple closed figure formed by union of line segments. The line segments forming a polygon are called sides. The point where two sides meet is called vertex. The name of the polygons tells us how many sides vertices that is plural form for vertex and angles it has. 
A regular polygon has all sides equal in length and all the angles are of equal measures. While irregular polygons can have sides of any length and angles can be of any measure. Direction Draw its prescribed polygon on a sheet of paper. Number 1 Square Pwede kayong gumawa ng kahit anong laki ng square. Ito ay halimbawa lamang. Number 2 Pentagon Ang pentagon ay merong limang sides. Sa pagkakataong ito, ang number 3, heptagon, number 4, octagon, at number 5, decagon, ay kayo naman ang gagawa. Directions. Name its polygon. Put your answers on a sheet of paper. Number 1, that is quadrilateral. Ang quadrilateral ay merong 4 sides. Number 7, number 8, number 9, number 10, ay kayo naman ang magsasagot. Andrew is helping her mother clean the kitchen cabinet. While rearranging the food display in the cabinet, he noticed that the containers have different shapes. There are sardines, corned beef, and tuna in cans, and condiments in bottles. There are also milk in boxes, boxes of toothpaste, and bar of soaps. Can you tell what shapes do these objects have? All the things that we see inside and outside our houses come in different shapes. Canned goods like sardines are cylindrical in shape. The box of milk, box of toothpaste, and bar of soap come in the shape of a rectangular prism. The eyes on the freezer are cube in shape. The balls we use for playing and the coconut fruits on the tree are spherical in shapes. The tent we use for camping may come in the shape of a rectangular prism or a pyramid. These figures are called solid figures. Solid figures are figures that have three dimensions such as length, width, and height. How do we describe a solid figure? Let us look at the characteristics of the different solid figures. The solid figure on the left has faces or sides that are polygons. These faces meet at edges which are line segments. Each end point of an edge is called a vertex. Letter A, cube. Cube is a solid figure with six congruent faces. It has six faces. Let us count. One, two, three, four, five the front view and six the back view. 12 edges. Let us count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. And 8 vertices. Let us count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 
vertices. Prisms are solid figures that have parallel faces that have the same shape. These faces of each sides are parallelograms. That is triangular prism. A triangular prism has five faces, nine edges, six vertices, while rectangular prism has six faces. 12 edges and 8 vertices. Take note, a cube is also a prism. Next is pyramid. Pyramid is a solid figure made up of base and rectangular faces. These faces meet at a common topmost point called the vertex. The vertex is also called the apex of the pyramid. The edges that meet the vertex are called lateral edges. That is rectangular pyramid. Next is square pyramid and pentagonal pyramid. A regular pyramid is a pyramid with a regular base and with lateral edges of equal length. Take note, rectangular prisms and the pyramids are also called polyhedrons because each one has many faces and every face is a polygon. Cylinder. Cylinder is a solid figure that has two circles, bases, and curved lateral face. Next is cone. Cone a solid figure that has circular flat base and a curved base pointed towards the top. The pointed top end of the cone is called the apex. Last is a spear. A spear is a solid figure in which all points are of equal distance from a point called its center. And these points form a curved surface as well. Directions. Write the name of its solid figure on a sheet of paper. Sagutan natin ang 1 and 2, then ang 3, 4, 5, kayo naman ang magsasagot. Number 1, that is cube. Number 2, that is cylinder. For number 6 to 10, sasagutan natin ng 6 and 7, then 8, 9, and 10, kay naman. So, number 6 is rectangular prism. Number 7, cone. Directions. Copy the table on a sheet of paper and complete the data by writing the number of edges faces and vertices of the given solid figures. Sagutan natin ng cube. Ilan ang vertices ng cube? There are 8. Faces, there are 6. Edges, there are 12. While rectangular prism, there are 6 vertices, 5 faces, and 9 edges. Ang rectangular prism, 
triangular pyramid and square pyramid, kayo naman ang magsasakot. Direction, choose the solid figure in column B that is represented by the following objects in column A. Write your answer on a sheet of paper. Number 1, ice cube represented by cube. Number 2, tissue roll that is cylinder. Number 3, match box rectangular prism. Then, sagutan nyo naman ng 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Choose the correct word from the box to complete the sentence. Write your answer on a sheet of paper. Choices are apex, cord, cylinder, edge, length, polyhedron, solid figure, spear, triangular, and vertex. A figure that has three dimensions is called solid figure. And the last, the end point of an edge is called vertex. Sa mga hindi ko sinagutan, batid ko, kayang-kaya nyo yung mga ito, good luck sa inyo. Directions. Write true if the statement is correct and false if it is not correct. Write answers on a sheet of paper. Number 1. A solid figure can be seen and touched. True. Number 2. A cube is also a prism. That is true. 3. All solid figures have straight faces. Oh, that is false. So, for number 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10, kayo na ang bahala. For additional activities, directions on a sheet of paper, list down two objects that resembles the following solid figures. Number 1, cube. Number 2, Rectangular Prism 3, Pyramid 4, Cone 5, Cylinder and 6, Spear Maraming salamat sa inyong panonood Hanggang isa muli Samahan niyo ako sa mga susunod pang mga videos Huwag kakalimot na mag-subscribe Pwede kayo mag-comments Mag-like at i-share ang ating mga videos Hanggang isa muli, paalam